But hold on one second. How do you know this? How hold you know? on one second. Where is your evidence? Where right. Is your evidence? Okay. Name me, name me an Islamic organization that, that does as much as the Catholic Church in terms of charitable outreach. So this is a nice story that you've achieved in at the park. But I sort of did some heckling because I sort of wanted to do some pushback against this. So give me believe, your evidence. I don't believe that. Give me your evidence. Uh, evidence. When I was saying that the Catholic Church is the biggest charitable no, giving I, organization, you were mocked it and you said I was wrong. Are you willing to take that back? No. And then you go into your own kind of rhetoric around Islam and an unorganized group of paedophile rings to justify an organized biggest religion with masses of power throughout the centuries hiding that paedophilia. So, bro, you, 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 you came up with some rubbish that the, the church doesn't do a lot to help. Uh, the poor. What, where, where are you getting that information from? You know, and they spread all that nonsense. You know, they just speak all nonsense, don't they? The church. Sorry, sorry. No, we're talking. We're talking about factual stuff, sure. right? So we're not talking about bullshit, quips, or 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 platitudes. We're talking about charitable output, going to help the poor. What have we changed the doing? Framework? Have we no, no, no. No, one second. Like... One second. Okay. Yeah, I, you, I was talking about the charity that the church does to the poor, yeah. and I said that we Christians. Yeah do more than any other group. No, wait, what, right, so, evidence, please, evidence, evidence, evidence so, yeah. So this is a great evidence to, uh, generator, isn't it? Yeah, go on, let's, let's, so let's go to like, evidence. You go with largest charity. Yeah. yeah. Is it? So the Catholic really Church. This. This guy, all the let, let, go, go on, go on, need this. go on, pull it up. What, 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 what have we got? Largest yeah, charity. Just trying to spell it. Largest charitable, largest charitable output. Apparently it's the uh, Nova Nordisk Foundation. Oh, Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. Oh, by 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 oh, that's wealth. We do right. it by wealth. So so by wealth. Now yeah. let let's compare the yeah. work of Bill and Melinda Gates. Yeah, let's do it. Right? They 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 focus on medical uh, making making medical um, treatments available to the poorest. They do. And I laud them for it. Good, me too. Not criticizing them for <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah. But, the, but every parish church yeah. of the Catholic Church in every diocese will be doing things to help the poor. Didn't that Catholic I, no, Church one second, some terrible stuff? One second, well. one second, one second, one second. What am I talking if about? You, if, you co if you go, yeah, I know, but if no, you go, like generally. no, 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 bro, bro, yeah. right? You, we're, we're just talking facts. I'm just asking okay. you to deal in facts, not platitudes, okay. not nonsense. Let's do it. Right? Because that's what you're dealing with right now. Yeah, I pulled out the, I pulled yeah. out the evidence One second, generator. one generator second. Evidence. Yeah, let's look and at that. Let's second. look at that. Let's look at that. Okay. I am telling you yeah. that every parish church yeah. of the Catholic Church yeah. in the entire world yeah. does output that is charitable in its communities. Fair enough. How big is that? Uh, so look, it, all we got to do, we say there's loads of nodes. How big spread, is that? We, there's loads of nodes spread around different countries and they all do a certain amount for their community. Brilliant. So then we can sum up that totally and be like, oh, that's at that level. Yeah, but I could sort of produce some other things that do some other great work. Can you, what, what other organization can you compare to the Catholic Church in terms of its reach? In terms of its reach? Well, um, the Bill Gates and Melinda Foundation, they, they, that's quite well its known. Its scope is narrow. No, 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 it's infected. Its scope is, its scope is purely medicinal. It's affected, I, I remember I said infected, affecting millions of people. I, I'm, not, I'm not knocking them. But I'm okay. just pointing out it's not as big as the Catholic Church. Well, I just pulled out the thing. Apparently, it's second large, second. The Bill and the Melinda Gates Foundation yeah. don't do charity work in London. Hey, well, what else, what Sorry, one second. Do yeah. the bill? Do, where, where's the branch that I can go to get my medicines in London? No, no, they don't do that. Oh, but the Catholic Church does. Yeah, yeah. Well, they do some. They don't give you medicine, do they? Oh, actually, they do. Actually, <laughs> yes, they do. Actually, there are Catholic hospitals mm. in London. Mm. So you're wrong again. I know, wrong once. No, no not even you, wrong. you've been, not, not even you've wrong, been, you've been wrong. Not even so, wrong. Not so even when wrong, we, just shown something. so when we not look at, wrong, just shown so, something. so when we look just at, so when we look at, when we look at Catholic schools, Catholic hospitals, the the food maybe, bank, the food uh, banks maybe, maybe, established in churches. Now bear in mind, maybe, bro. Maybe maybe, maybe um, Islamic culture then would have the same sort of thing. Ah, hold on, hold yeah, on, yeah, hold they, on. They've got a principle of like. Let, let, let's look at that. Let's, we can sort of pit religions against. Yeah, yeah, each we other. can yeah. pit religions against one another. Yeah. We can pit religions yeah. against one another. I, I, in terms of, but in terms of your statement. Yeah. I said what that the Catholic statement? Church. I said that the Catholic Church was the biggest organization doing charitable work. Yeah. No, you no, said no, that you, was rubbish. No, no, no. You said it was the biggest charity. It is. 
the biggest charity. All right, maybe maybe we, I need to rephrase this ever no, so slightly. Yeah. That it that it anyway, is. Anyway, we're, 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 pro- we're totally stuck in the weeds in this debate. No, we're really not, because because yeah. I've got facts so, so, so you and think, you've got platitudes. So if we like sort of get away from the, the actual conflict and we look at it, it looks like you're saying the Catholic Church is the strongest beacon of light within the communities that are doing good work. That's what you're saying. No, what I said was that you were mocking from the sidelines. I was. I was. Yes, thank you. Yeah. Was that the Catholic Church does more charitable work than any other single organization on earth and that is a fact but hold on one second how do you know this how hold you know? on one Where second is your evidence? Where right is your okay evidence? name me name me an islamic organization that that does as much as the catholic church in terms of charitable output that's not evidence there are entire monastic orders mm. dedicated to good works mm. and charitable output like like the white fathers mm. that work in africa do you know what they do no no idea no what about the sisters of mercy do you know what they do no, no, no exactly. You don't know nothing. But I asked so, you to produce some evidence, and you asked me. I've just given you two. I've just given you exactly. I've just given you two organisations. Yeah. No, you didn't. The, you said the, there was a monastic to, order, to, and you said I've given you two a... organisations within the Catholic Church mm. that do charitable work right across Africa, helping the poorest of the poor. Mm. Do you know what Opus Dei do? No idea. No, of course you don't. Because you don't know anything, you've just got platitudes. Oh, okay. Opus Day. Opus Day. Opus Day as part of their Opus Day. Opus Day. Opus Day. Opus Day. Opus Day. Are you willing to admit that you were wrong in what you said? What did I say? When I was saying that the Catholic Church is the biggest charitable no, giving I... organization, you were mocked it and you said I was wrong. Are you willing to take that back? No. no. Right. No. Then produce your evidence to show me that I'm wrong. Okay, then. so what, we're saying biggest. So what do we want to know? Do we want to know so, what is? is that a no, lot? hold on, hold on, here's a go. Here's it. Biggest in scope. In scope? Biggest in output. Let's just get rid of the scope one. That's why, one. why? Because it's, it's so, a definition that doesn't work for you. No, because it's retardedly subjective. No, it it's isn't. A, it's a very scope, objective definition. My scope is to if we're comparing, my If we're comparing a charity that only works in part in Africa on a charity that works in every part of the world, then scope is an objective measurement, isn't it? Uh, it, it, it depends. It, isn't it? We can change the definition isn't of it? the word scope to encompass something that I'm we talking about measure. geographical scope. Uh, so, well, the, we, no, you should talk about it like population influence. Um, in, in terms of population influence, yeah, I'll still back the Catholic Church against any organisation you put up against it. That guy agrees with that. And this, and this, by the way, is before I add on to the Catholic Church, all the work of the Orthodox Church, all the work of the Anglican Church, Oh, well, he's not even listening. What is all the, the work of the Salvation the Army, the Catholic, the Catholic all the work USA of all Catholic the work of the Church of England, all the work of the Baptist Church, all the work of the Seventh Day Adventist Church, all the work. You know, my list goes on. The, all the work of the Evangelical Funds, all the work of the Evangelical Churches. So I add all of these things. I don't know what this is. This is just a private website. That could be I, nice. did, you, did you even listen to what I just said? Yeah, you listed a load of uh, institutions that you're going to add on to the charity of the Catholic Church. Brilliant. And then you were going to make a second point. Yeah, yeah. And, and so the point is, yeah. the point is yeah. that all of these things is my community. We Christians mm. are the ones leading in charitable work mm. everywhere. So this is a nice story that you're producing at the park. But I sort of did some heckling because I sort of wanted to do some pushback against this. So I give me your evidence. I don't believe that... Give me your evidence. Uh, evidence. Can I, I'll read it if he doesn't. What, what's the source? Inquirer.net, which he calls bullshit because it's about to contradict him. <laughs> but the Catholic Church is more than a spiritual institution, apparently using the strategy of non-coercive power, Deus Volt, the geopolitics of the Catholic Church 2010. The church runs 5,500 hospitals, 18,000 clinics, 16,000 homes for the elderly, and those with special needs, with 65% of them located in underdeveloped and developing countries. Let's have a look at their numbers again. What is it? Uh, of Catholic Church. Da-da-da. The church runs 5,500 hospitals, 1,800 clinics, 18,000 clinics, 16,000 homes for the elderly. Of them located in undeveloped and developing countries. Lovely. Yep. Quite, quite okay. Nice, so, 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 give me, give me, and that, and believe me, that's not even a com- that's not even a complete list of all the things that the Catholic no, Church does. It's not even a roundup. That's a very small list of all the things. What about all the, what about all the food banks in all the parishes? Mm. 
What about the fact of all the, the, the non-recognised charitable works that we Christians do? Because every Catholic who gives to St. Is it St. So St. Peter's Pence or St. Simon's Pence? St. Peter's Pence, which is a collection that's done regularly for the poor and the underprivileged in the parish. The, the, the sort of the what's charitable the point, work. Point, My point is, in yeah. terms of charitable output, yeah. that all counts for the Catholic Church. That's all for the Catholic Church. Every, every, so Catholic, their, every Catholic who actions. acts because of their faith mm. charitably mm. counts towards the charitable output of the Catholic Church. It does, and we can minus all, Brilliant. Those, and we can minus all those that have tried to get rid of their religion and their like, affiliation with all of this nonsense and sort of just act goodly on their own behalf. And yeah, they're not part of the Catholic Church, no, so yeah, we, exactly. we do minus those. So yeah, absolutely. other charities that we could look at to see how large they are. Yeah, so give me one. And also, we could total, we could total all of them individuals that are not acting give on the Give me side one. Of the, the, give me a single institution as big as the Catholic Church involved in charitable work. That's not the framework that we were setting up there. We were framing No, 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 no. You, I, I made a claim yeah, you about did. the Catholic Church you that you mocked, which means yeah, that the, the definement of the charitable cause is the one that I set up because I made about the Catholic Church, which means we're using the Catholic Church as the model. So you've got to come up with an institution yeah. that is bigger than the Catholic Church, that does more charitable work than the Catholic Church, okay. that influences more people than the Catholic Church towards charity. Which is it? You haven't compared the Catholic Church to anything else. What about all the Muslims and their 10%? 10% Muslims, yeah, the guy says. Oh, I, I tried that one. It's as actually 2.5%, well. it's not 10%. Well, Christians give 10%. Okay, compared, Christians give 10%, bro. Muslims no, give 2.5%. Is, is that my homework, anyway? Is that my homework to check it? Oh, well, just, the, the, just, the thing is, you. No, no, hold on. Yeah. You mocked my claim about the Catholic I, Church. I did, I did. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So now you mm. have to bring forward an organization. Yeah. That is as big as the Catholic no, two, Church. No, two things can actually happen. Go on, bring uh, up, bring. What's the organisation? Uh, no, 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 not, not what's the. Organization. We can look at the Catholic Church and get a number or a, a measurement for its influence and effect. You can't. Charitable... It's too big. <laughs> That is not a genuine. That's not a genuine response. No one has been able to do the study you're asking it Matt, to do. You are, this is why, when I first saw you, you're a crusader because you are blindly following one line. I, I, I am proud to say I am a crusader. And nothing, I'm proud to say I am a crusader. Nothing ever went wrong with crusaders, did they? They always did honourable good. Are, are you trying to change the subject? No, I'm not. You, you, you let me down. He is trying to change the subject, isn't he? He let me down. He let me down a path. No, you made a claim and he just refuted it. So either I made, it. I made a claim. Just, claim? just have the, the just have the decency to retract. No, Just have no, the decency no, no, no. to retract no, no, what no. you said no, 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 no. or prove that I'm wrong. He said, when, when I said that the Catholic Church is the biggest organisation involved in charitable output, he laughed at that, said I was talking rubbish. So now he has to produce an organisation that's bigger, that's doing the same. So you have to give the second in line for that charitable work. You know, you're saying it's biggest, you've given numbers, you haven't given dollar amount. Don't you have to compare that to the second biggest in order to say it's the biggest? No, we already found that by dollars, by wealthiest charity, we've already found that Bill Gates and Melinda Gates Foundation is second. Um, so. Is that true? I don't. I don't. Yeah, I, that was from the Google. Really all the, all so, the so, so, but, but in, but, but, but in terms, but the, the comparison is a flawed one because he mocked a claim about the Catholic Church. So he has to find an organisation that has the same scope and breadth and width and depth as the Catholic Church. Bearing in mind and that the Catholic Church, the well. Catholic Church, in terms of its charitable work, does things like medical care, social care, prison care, prison chaplaincy work. Social reform, criminal reform. It, it also, it also, it also supports the charities in terms of the production and preservation of art, culture. It sponsors music. This is the full scope like of wonderful, the Catholic Church. It is an amazing it organization. Is it, it is an, an amazing organization. And this is before, bro, yeah. I pull in all of the other Christians who are also involved in charitable work yeah. and good deeds. The Salvation Army, let's just so deal with this brother's go, point. Go on in, go, follow, follow in. Let, let's, just, uh, let's just take the pressure off this guy because he's obviously, he's obviously out of bullets. No, but let's just deal with no, this guy. No, no, let's no, let's just on, deal with this guy. Let's just deal with this guy. Let's just deal with this guy. He came, he claimed falsely. Yeah, but you're not, you just heckled me from us. So give me your evidence. I've already pulled out evidence to do with one and here's, criteria. And did you not low. listen? I no, refuted I your evidence. Keep just marching on. I'm trying to reflect. Let's, let's refute the, the evidence.
sense. You, let's you, let's review. We are constru- we are let's constrained. review. No, I can, look, I can no, shout louder than you. No, this is the battle. I really no, can is, shout louder than you. So let, let's try. do Go a conversation. No, no, I'm going to try. No, no, no. Hold the conversation. No, no, let's have a no, conversation. No, no, no. Look at Bill Gates, Melinda Gates. They spend. Billions, should I shout, guys, billions, or should I just talk? All sorts of people. Right. They spend it all over the place on vaccines. They try and raise people out of poverty. They try and enlighten people. This influences the whole world. Can I get charity work? Can I get charity from the Bill Gates Foundation in London? No. no Can I get charity from the Catholic Church in London? Their, their yes. Their scope is different. They've got billions of people that they're trying to focus on. Their They've scope is narrow. By the way, I, I, I lord. Oh, why, 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 why are you frightened? Sorry. There we go. So in terms no, 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 of in terms of the scope, in terms of bro, bro, bro. Yeah. Bro, in ter- I'm going you know to deal with your this evidence. This is why I can't make a point, because you don't let me make a point. Uh, you, you, you did make a point. You mentioned the Bill Gates Foundation. Yeah, this is yeah, the yeah. evidence. Yeah, 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 so right. I'm going to refute the evidence. The, the, ev- the way that I refute stuff. the claim yeah. and the evidence that's presented is because the evidence that is presented doesn't match the criteria. The criteria was the Catholic Church because no, that was Catholic the claim that I made. Catholic no, it was. It was Catholic the Catholic. Not a criteria. Okay, by criteria, I'm going to mean, talk to you guys. By criteria, you, mean you all heard me make a claim about the Catholic Church. He heckled that claim about the Catholic Church, which means that rightly, in the course of the argument, the criteria is the Catholic Church. Sure, so what are he has Christian? to do is he has to yeah. find the evidence that is as broad in scope as the Catholic hell. Church and is as broad in scope as the output it's of the Catholic God, Church. And notice he doesn't Why want to deal Why with the evidence. You, so I'm going to no. deal with your point now. I'm going to deal with your point. No, 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 no. I'm going to deal with your point. No, I'm going to deal with your point. So you claimed, no, let me let me deal with your first point. Yeah, you will, you will. We'll do a comeback, we'll do a comeback, we'll do a comeback. Go on, go on, make your point and then I'll deal with both of them. I'm not making an argument or a point. I was clarifying the, the issues. To be honest, my from my observer point of view, I don't actually know what you're trying to like. If you win, what does that mean? If you win, what does that mean? Right. So, so I'm going to deal with both points. I'll deal with your latter point first, and then I'll deal with the your, your, your earlier point. So, so don't touch the camera, bro. It's not your camera. So, in terms of, in terms of, in terms of, what's going to happen if I do? Well, I'm going to take your hand off it. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah, that's what. I'm get, yeah, if you touch the camera, I'm going to take your hand off because it's not your property. It's not your property. Is it your property? No, it's not your property. It's not my property, but no, it's not your property. Trust me, I've got JC's permission to touch his camera, you don't. No, but you haven't got yeah. permission to touch me. Well, if you touch someone else's property, uh, I do have permission because I'm protecting someone else's camera, property. You're a policeman. It's JC. Go and ask JC if I can touch his camera. I bet yeah, JC. So, I bet so JC now let's come back. Let's come back. Yeah, let, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to come back. I'm going to come back. moving the camera so, slightly. Yeah, go and ask him. Me. Go and ask him. I will. Go and ask him. I will. Right. So let's deal with let's deal with his point. Yes. So his point was made. His point was made. He's saying, uh, he's saying such, he's saying, go go away. He's saying, he's saying, he's saying, he's saying, he's saying, he's saying, he's saying that the, that, that, that the brother was asking, what was the point of this discussion? Here's the point of this discussion. Amongst critics of Christianity, there are a load of misconceptions outright lies and myths that are spoken about Christians. How, and when that, we Christians challenge those people that perpetrate these lies, these myths, these stereotypes, these prejudices, and we challenge them to prove what they are saying, this is the reaction that we get. No, 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 this is no, the no, reaction no, we get. We say, we say it. produce the evidence. You're so what's at stake is simply this, an accurate view of the Christian community yes. versus the lies and stereotypes that are common currency amongst the critics of the Christian community. Now to your first point, sir, which you mentioned about Islam, which you mentioned about Islam and you said, Compare, compare, compare Islam's 10%, compare Islam's 10%, compare Islam's 10% to Christianity's charitable output. And I corrected the bro and I said that Muslims don't give 10%, they give 2.5%. But secondly, Muslims don't give 2.5% in charity. It's a tax. 
It's an obligation. It's a redistributive oh, tax. You, you, you it labeled, isn't you, charity. You, you Christians, you Christians you give out of a cheery Christians and joyful of heart. We, our 10% that we Christians give is not an obligation. It is not an obligation. I'm going to finish my point and then he can talk. He just has to have patience. That's all he needs to do. So we Christians give out of a joyful and cheerful heart. We don't have to give 10%. Lovely. Some Christians that? give more than 10%. Lovely. Well done, and I'm that is why the Christian community doing. is punching well above his weight Lovely. in charitable giving. What a beautiful right, story. there you go, bro. Now, let's look at some of the other criticisms that are levied against or given to uh, Christian faith and the Christian, the whole Bible, the whole, the whole organization that you're trying to say. Are you retracting your first one? Now that is a cheating in the argument. No, it isn't. You no, it isn't. Point. You were the one you saying, that heckled me off camera. I challenged you and you Catholic? said, you and you've refused to retract it. Retract what you've said. That's all you need to do. And then we can about, talk about something else. Are you talking about the size of the Catholic charity? So that, so all of that time, we're still on that point. The, all yeah, of this time, we haven't gone anywhere. He hasn't you started it by heckling. Millions of trees of thought. And he just brings you back to this one trunk. Yeah, you just retract headless. what you said because and you're wrong, bro. You could even chop that trunk of that whole tree down. I showed you a bigger charity. You so showed me, so but it wasn't bigger. Kind of, say, there was is it bigger? bigger? Yes. It has How money. is it bigger than the Catholic more Church? More money. Where? Uh, more money. In one criterion, more and money. Yeah, I, money. I dispute even that, to be honest. You dispute that? Yes. In Google. Yes, because the wealth of the Catholic Church is in its property and land. How much land and property does the Catholic Church own? Oh, I think it's about three to four trillion, I'm not sure. Right, so far bigger than Google, far bigger than Bill Gates. This is, this is what you're saying, yeah, because it's factual. Because a lot of the time, yeah, people like me and you, yeah. it's wrong to make assumptions, but we make assumptions about religion, we make assumptions about faith. In real terms, they're doing a lot as well. I in, in real terms, I, I seriously, in real, whatever way you want to look at it, they're doing a lot, man. But this is not whatever way. They, and that's before. Lot, they get a lot. No, no. Go on, bro. Go on. They yeah. They do. Yeah, they do. You've got to look at it holistically, and you think about the ethics and the way they they, they, they see things. Yeah. So they're doing a lot, and we've been influenced a lot. A little bit. By, I agree with that as well. Yeah. You because agree with that. Trying to What's your point? My point that is, you can't just crusade for a single thing of positivity with the Catholic Church. It's going to have to always be a fluctuating criticism, balance. No, that wasn't the, the point that you made, bro. I, he's not screwing. That's not the point he's that he made. No, no. The we point that he know. made, bro, was that when I said that the Catholic Church was the biggest charitable organisation, he said that I was wrong. You are wrong. So we're dealing in facts. You are wrong. So we're you are dealing wrong. in facts. What? Well, how am I wrong? In my pocket. No, 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 no. Wherever my pocket how much is. money? How much money does the Catholic Church have locked up in land? Your no, no, I'm gonna... Bro, everyone, everyone recognizes a fact that you refuse to recognize. What? So you've changed it. You're saying the Catholic it's just a so fact. Much money because they own land. That's what you're saying. Oh. No, I pointed out that you were even wrong in that way. They got all the church. You got all the building in yeah. there. Yeah. They should share it out if they got so much money, shouldn't they? And that, bro, bro, don't get me. That, bro. Do you really believe in like concentrated oh, no. wealth? Come on, no. bro. I, I, I disagree with that. I mean, all bro. land yeah. was effectively gotten by. Blood. By violence and, yeah, and, yeah, yeah. and blood. The, the, Everyone, that's why travelling people like myself believe it's a fucking height of shit. Yeah. And we can basically plot up wherever the fuck they want. Yeah. I suppose that's one way of living. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and no, no, I don't live like that. I'm a settled man myself. Oh, yeah, I imagine you are. But all this land here, how do you think it was got? Like you already said, by violence. You already said. E exactly that. Yeah? Yeah. The biggest history, man, history the biggest man in blood. Fuck you. No, no, with respect, but that statement's not true either. You don't think history's covered in blood? No, history is covered in blood. Yeah. But but ultimately, ultimately, there's there's lots of ways that land is exchanged. Why is it we can't why why do we why do we resort to simplistic characterizations? Because we're in the park. The, the, the reality is, the reality is, the reality is, the reality is. <laughs> Lots of lots of land was simply donated to the Catholic Church. This is risk. Okay. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying the Catholic Church didn't conquer land as well. It certainly did. You know, look at the Teutonic Knights in Eastern Europe. But I'm not. I'm not denying that the Catholic Church did conquer land. But what I'm saying is, it isn't the case that all the land that's owned by the Catholic Church was simply conquered. Lots of it was donated. Yeah, I know. So this is we're going to go down a rabbit hole. So so why why can't why can't you just deal in facts, bro? Okay, because let's, let's, on every let's, statement let's, that you've made, you're factually wrong. Let's, let's deal in facts. I asked the audience, what is the largest charity by, by wealth that... That, that, that is not the scope that you were mocking I earlier. 
The, here's the thing, here's the thing, guys. For those of you that came late, I made a statement about, about wait one second. I made a statement about the Catholic Church. I said that the Catholic Church was the biggest organization involved in charitable work. And this brother, and this brother, like this, like this sister behind, just jumps in and says that I'm speaking rubbish. Which means that, which means that the model that we need to check ourselves against is the Catholic Church. We've got to find an organization that is as big as the Catholic Church and that does charitable work. So, We've got to talk in facts. So, Bob, two, two, two things, two things. One thing I asked JC about that, he said it was fine, so you're wrong. Yeah. yeah. Let, me, let, 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 let me go and, let me go and let, talk to JC. Yeah, 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 we'll bring JC in. We'll go speak to JC. He hasn't got authority we'll go over his own mind and own go on. beliefs. Go on. Go on. Jesus. I don't think you probably violent, told him the full context, but anyway. Violent Christians. Wait, hold on, hold on, that's not the point of the topic that we no, were no, talking no, about. I'm getting on to that. When he so, retracts, point, 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 when he retracts point, the point, comment point, that he made, okay. the point so, that we're debating is about whether the Catholic Church is the biggest organisation involved in charity. Asking, and asking. notice the critics are jumping from every no, topic no, no, that they I was can. No, referring back to a point made earlier. Oh look, he's put you on camera. Oh, okay, Go on, <laughs> grab his camera now oh, and move it. Go on. No, you don't. He's... <laughs> right, go on. Okay, so the, 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 world, the wealthiest foundations by endowment value is, number one is the Novo Nordisk Foundation. Yeah, I got that one. Wait, 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 wait. Bill and Gates is next. Stitched in. Welcome, Trust. Yeah, we've done that one. We've done this. No, so, okay, yeah, but... Hello, everyone on YouTube. You should come down here. <laughs> Welcome, Trust. Then the Buddhist Foundation. Later down, later down is the Church of England. But the bottom line is all of these, if you look at the starting date, the founded date for these uh, foundations, 1989, 1994, 1982, 1980, so these are so big and they've been doing it in the last 40, 50 years. So now allow me to address that evidence. Compared to the Catholic Church, which politically uh, has, uh, you know, effectively commandeered a lot of money rather than act into their base. Actually, well. actually, you're, 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 you're utterly wrong. Here. Utterly wrong. No, no, fact, utterly no, wrong. No, no, oh, no, you did not. You asked. Yeah, the fact, the fact you asked. that you <laughs> jump on an iPhone and accept that information as gospel yeah, is ridiculous. Yeah, I, I think Good point, mate. Okay. So, 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 yeah, yeah. Like, like, here's why I think that this brother is factually wrong. Because this conversation started by me making a, cl a specific claim that this brother mocked and then this brother chirped in because he wanted to back him. Yeah. No, so the, the model, I want, I want the model, the model, the model, the model that we need to find is something that is as broad in scope as the Catholic Church. Broad in terms of its geography, broad in terms of its charitable concerns. And I would bet the Catholic Church against any one of those organizations that I suspect are narrower in their geographical and in their charitable output. In other words, they will be special interest groups like the Bill Gates and Melinda Foundation is a wonderful organization doing brilliant work purely based upon making medicines available to the poorest. Fantastic. But that is not same in scope to the Catholic Church that covers a whole range of charitable causes far bigger in scope than the Bill Gates Foundation and far broader in terms of its global output. Because the, the foundation of Bill Gates, the biggest one on your list... No, it's not. It's Nova Nordisk. Okay, I mean, I don't genuinely know what Nova Nordisk does, but I'll bet you, I'm willing to make a bet that it's similar. My criticism of the Bill Gates foundation as evidence is also true of the Novid one. You'd have to labour it. But the point is, the difference between some of these organisations, I can't speak for them all, that the Catholic Church um, gives that charity and the cost of it is either to uh, pull people into the belief in hell and cause suffering or a large proportion, not a large proportion, a, a highly um, sanitised situation of all the paedophilia by, by um, priests. Okay, so let me just deal with that. Okay, so now, now we're gonna, we are, I'm going to get broaden the conversation now. You're the boss. Yep. <laughs> yep. So let me, let me, let me, sister, come forward, come and join us. Okay, so in terms, let me just deal with his point, sister, and then you come back with your point, yeah? Let me just deal with this bro's point. So, so in terms of, in terms of this idea of missionary work, being connected to the idea of drawing people into the, the Catholic Church, 
I want to say, first and foremost, I got no problem with that. There's nothing wrong with that at all. But however, I would also point out that it is a false characterization that the Catholic Church has this idea that you either accept our charity and our faith or you can't have our that. charity. Because the Catholic Church, 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 the Catholic Church will do its charity regardless. It'll do its charity regardless of whether you become a Catholic. That's just how good it is. It is good. It is good. It is good. Bringing in questions like paedophilia. Let's, let's, let's just deal with the, the criticism of paedophilia. It's absolutely true that the Catholic Church utterly failed on this question. Paedophile rings did manage to embed themselves in the Catholic Church because of the weaknesses of the institution. But those same problems, those same problems, those same problems exist in society. They exist in society. They are. It is part of human nature, sadly. It, it, is, it is a sexuality. It is a sexuality. That's the only way you can explain its prevalence. I wonder what kind of job attracts people with that sexuality, that pro propensity. I'm sorry, but you're, 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 this is, now notice, notice, if someone made the kind of generalizations, if someone made the kind of generalizations against Muslims that the, 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 the liberals here are making about Catholics, they would be called Islamophobic. But yet, when they deal in stereotypes that Catholic priests are all paedophiles, no one calls them of being, no one accuses them of being guilty of a thought crime, which only demonstrates, which only demonstrates the hypocrisy of our liberal society that this man thinks that he can deal in that kind of prejudice. No, Go on, push his camera away making, now. Push his camera making, away now. You yeah? are making a, a straw man <laughs> argument. Bro, bro, bro. You're bro, telling me. Bro. You, you, stand, you stand away from the camera. You stand away from the camera. Yeah. So. Typical. So. Typical. Typical. So, so there we go. There we go. Typical Christian. There we go. So, so the, so the brother. So the thing is, Bob. Yeah. yeah there you go. Okay. Look at that. So yeah. The thing is, Bob. It's a straw man. No. Nope. You're, you're dealing straw man. You're dealing in a straw man. You're dealing in a straw man. You've had your loud voice moment. I know you have a loud voice. It's brilliant. Yeah, I can do a loud voice. I'm trying not to do the loud voice. I really am. <laughs> you're not doing very well. So anyway, if I say, I wonder what kind of jobs attract those people with that uh, sexual proclivity. It's not the same saying all Catholic priests are, are paedophiles. So if you, it's just a very, very clear straw man argument if you put that word into my mouth. Yes. Nice try, Bob. So, hold on one second. Hold on one second. The, the fact of the matter is... Oh, oh, go on, battery. The fact of the matter is... I'm going to let him do his... I'm going to do his chat. So, it, it is this kind of... It is, this is why I have to raise my voice, because people can't contain themselves. They make, it is a free world, which is why, after a while, when people persistently interrupt... There we go, I have to raise my voice. But if I shout, people say, why do you shout? You know, again and again and again. But this kind of, this kind of slurring, this kind of slurring of the Catholic priesthood diminishes the great and the good work of many Catholic priests. They shouldn't have done it. It then. is, it is, they, they. The people who is he it. talking about? The, the whole priesthood? The no. no that's, that. that's the, they shouldn't have done it. The fact of the matter is, there are paedophiles, there are paedophiles in every part of our society. Paedophiles operate in schools. We've had paedophile rings of Muslim men abuse children in the north of England. Thousands of them systematically. That, that was ignored by the liberal state because the liberal state couldn't call a spade a spade. But, but when we point out, when we point out that there were Muslim paedophile gangs raping children in the north of England, the Muslims call us Islamophobes. But
that when a liberal secularist points out the failures of paedophilic rings in the Catholic Church, no one accuses him of a thought crime. So that is the hypocrisy that we're talking about. So, can we go back to talking? 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 Let's go back to talking. So my okay, point to you is, no, let, let, you said, oh, no, 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 because no, if you want a truth, if you, then you need to give me the first word. No, no, no. Oh no, no, no. no, no, no. Then, then, then we'll shout then. But, but, so no, let, so no, let me, no, let me land on my point. No, I'm going to finish my point, no, then come back. So my point to you is, bro. My point to you is, bro. That there has definitely been a failure within the Catholic Church, but that does not mean. The, the, the Catholic Church is not the largest charitable organization in the world, which is how this conversation started, remember? So what I, the, the three points that I made is, one, the, la, the, la, the wealthiest, largest um, charitable organizations in the world are uh, the ones I listed out earlier, and they are only about 30 or 40 years old. The point I was making, which you didn't address, was that the Catholic Church has been going for more than 1,700 years. So the, that's uh, another issue. Right? I'll come back to that. And then the second uh, thing is, if I say, uh, you, you absolute straw man argument saying that I said all uh, priests are ex or, or paedophiles, all this, all that, and then you go into your own kind of rhetoric around Islam and an unorganized group of paedophile rings to justify an organized biggest religion with masses of power throughout the centuries hiding that paedophilia. So don't straw man me on that, that's all. Okay, so let me respond to those two points. Firstly, I did, I did address your point because the thing that you jumped into a conversation with a guy who's now run away, because he always does, is that we were talking, I made a claim about the charitable output of the Catholic Church. That heckler over there jumps in and he said, and he said, that's a load of rubbish. That's wrong. Are you listening? So what, hold on, wait one second, one second, one second. And so, so, and so, and so the model, the model that we're looking for is something comparable to the Catholic Church, which means we're using the Catholic Church as our model for the criterion, which means that whatever organization we compare to the Catholic Church has to be as broad in scope geographically, as broad in scope in its charitable output as the organization you're comparing it against. None of the organizations that you have presented meet that criterion. The only measurement that's being used there is of their finances. Their finances may be bigger than the Catholic Church organizationally in terms of what money's in the bank. But that doesn't mean that they are as broad as scope or as broad in geographical outreach as the Catholic Church, which is why I refute your evidence. Secondly, secondly, you made the point about 1700 years versus the modernity of these charities you mentioned. That only actually strengthens my argument. Why, Bob? Because that means that now, now I can appeal to all the charitable work that the Catholic Church has done for 1700 years. Right by what you have just said, which actually makes the evidence far stronger in my favor than in yours. And then you said, well, let's talk about the paedophilia. I didn't. I you talked, about you talked man. about, you I talked about, about that, that for 1700 years, the Catholic Church has been hiding this kind of sexual deviancy. That is a lie. The Catholic Church around, I think it was the year 800, um, institutionalized the idea of celibacy amongst its priests. Any priest carrying out sexual conduct of any nature is defying the teaching of the Catholic Church. So you're wrong, full stop and absolutely outright. Yes, there has been, yes, there has been in modern times a failure that the Catholic Church has owned up to paid billion, million, tens of millions of dollars for, rightly in compensation. <laughs> oh, why don't you just grab his camera? Listen. Yeah? Listen, young. So, so, where, where were you? So, <laughs> JC, do you want to come this way? JC. Okay, okay. Uh, a little, a little better. All right, here we go. Go. On. Yeah. So, so you're simply wrong, bro. No. In everything that you're saying. No, bro. You did not address what I said. And what what, what I did I miss? Was, okay, what you missed 
was I, the second point that I made was that you made very clear straw man arguments by generalising my statement and then saying, oh, poor Christianity, what about Islamophobia? What that is the straw man issue is what I'm addressing. None of the Catholic Church yet. I'm asking about your tendency to do straw man arguments and not admit it. Look, ah, okay, so let, let, let's talk about let's talk about whether it's a straw man. No, no, no. Can we here's a, here's a, here's a man. No, no. Here's a man. Here's a man. No, no. Before you do, you just, you just said your second point was about straw man yeah, arguments, yeah, so I'm going to address that. Fine. Before you go into a rhetoric, let's define what straw man argument I'm accusing you of. Go on then. So I said first two things. I said. I wonder what kind of jobs attract paedophiles. Yeah. And you went on to say, oh, he's saying all uh, priests are uh, paedophiles. And, I, and then another time when I was talking about the church, it was again, you generalise it all and you talked about Islam, Islamophobia, Christophobia, and that is the straw man argument that I'm addressing. Okay. So, if you're happy to do that, so, right. so, so here's the thing. The, those, that, that question that you asked wasn't just given in a vacuum. It was given in a context. And in the context of that conversation, you implied, either accidentally or deliberately, that the Catholic Church, the whole of the priesthood, was rife with paedophilia, was rife with the covering of paedophilia, and has been doing so for 1700 years. Those are the words that I have heard you say. No, 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 if you want to retract you, that no, impression no, no, or correct all, it, feel you, free. You reacted to what I said before I said any of those other things. And it's, and it's a you're, trope, you're, incidentally, saying, that's common currency what, amongst Bob, the middle class white English. Bob, what you're saying is that um, you, you Im what I'm implying or what I haven't said. If you want to know what I'm meaning or saying, then you can ask for clarification. So I'm asking you, clarify. You clarify. clarify. There is some high... Oh, some? Yeah. yeah. Some? Yeah. Okay, much better. Got no, no problem with that. I'd agree with that. I'd agree with that. I agree with that completely. There are some. And they're wrong. But here's the thing. The Catholic Church no, institutions no, celibacy. Is Where does it permit oh, paedophilia? Well, here is not the thing. You're talking about paedophilia in the Catholic Church. I'm talking about your tendency to do straw man arguments. Uh, well, I'm not interested in debating me. Right. Well, that's the part problem. You'll never I'm learn. In, I'm You'll not interested learn. in debating me. You, you, you jumped in. You jumped in. You, do, you jumped in. On, into a conversation about the Catholic Church. You made comments about the Catholic Church. I've tackled you on those comments. You can say whatever comments you like about me. I'm not yeah, interested. Yeah, sorry. This is, this not is, interested. This is called ignorance, isn't it? I'm, I, I, I've made a mistake and I don't give a shit, actually. I, 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 don't, I don't think I've... I don't think I've... I mean, even if I have made a mistake, I'll go back and watch the video. I'll correct myself. But the, the tropes that, that I've heard in this discussion that is common amongst the sort of liberal critics of the Christian faith, those kind of tropes, those kind of tropes, they are, they're, they're, just, they're just based on ignorance. We'll just move the camera, JC. We'll just move the camera. Yeah. All right, so what's happening, Joey? Are you going to start dancing yeah, around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Acting like, you know, your camera is shy or what's yeah, going yeah, yeah, on, bro? Camera. Yeah. So, so, so the thing is that these kind of... I'm gonna, we're going to wrap up because you've made the debate about me. I'm not interested in debating myself. The, the kind of tropes that we've heard are, are tropes amongst the, the so-called intelligentsia of England. These kind of bombastic, self-righteous, virtue-signalling hypocrites of, of Western uh, liberal progressive thought. The idea that the Catholic Church has money that it should give to the poor. The idea that it doesn't help the poor. The idea that it's, it's, it's rife with paedophilia that the priesthoods, and these things, let's be clear, we heard them, we heard, we've heard them mentioned by celebrities. They're, they're produced and, and, and populated by celebrities. Stephen Fry in a public debate. Christopher Hitchens. Uh, some two people I suspect are possibly people that John looks up to. Another lovely... Possibly, another possibly. Lovely Correct me if I'm wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. Do you like Christopher Hitchens? Do you like Christopher Hitchens? I'm asking you. Do you like Christopher Hitchens? I'm asking you. Are you shy? Do you like Christopher Hitchens? Do you like Christopher Hitchens? No, no, no. Are you not respecting my shyness? No, I'm not respecting your shyness. Speaker's Corner is not a place for shy people. Speaker's Corner is not. If you're shy, why are you here? If you're shy, why are you here? 
Why are you asking me? Uh, uh, so, notice that when I said that I suspect John looks up to people like Christopher Hitchens yeah. and Stephen Fry, yeah. he was very shy. <laughs> I suspect that silence is admission in this case. Yeah. Stephen Fry and Christopher Hitchens populated anti-Catholic tropes, populated Christophobic stereotypes, and yet, and yet they are celebrated by our liberal progressive elites, like John. So at the end of the day, even though, even though, even though, even though, even though, even though, even though you would know, John, you would know. Even oh, though, ladies and gentlemen, if you, if you did the same to the Islamic community, oh, you would be accused of Islamophobia. Ooh. So I'm calling out the hypocrisy of all you liberal elites. Brilliant. Brilliant.